turning into the new year, 2025, for India, supposed to be quite an exciting new year in terms of uh, their efforts into the outer space. Chairman of the Indian Space Agency actually announced that uh, there will be a first attempt by India to do space docking of two satellites. This will bring India to a very limited membership club of only three countries, now four, if they can do it. That's China, U.S., and Russia that's capable of doing this in, in space. Now, this, of course, is uh, part of the Indian plan to eventually send men into space and uh, to land on the moon. The plans announced by India is 2035 to build a station in space and then by 2040 to land on the moon. For India to be able to reach these achievements, uh, it will be very, very positive for mankind because mankind has always been seeking to explore outer space and, uh, and trying to find out more about what's beyond the Earth. And if India joins this club and adds additional effort to the mankind's effort, it will be very positive. However, it's not that easy because I think the latest announcement is that there could be some further delays for the automatic docking in space. It's uh, a great thing if they can achieve it, but uh, I think they're beginning to find that technologically uh, there are limitations still in terms of what they can achieve. Uh, we wish them good luck. Of course, like uh, as in many previous cases, the Indian media is very, very excited uh, every time when there are prospects or announcements of further advances in science and technology in India. It's uh, promoted actively by the media. It's good to build confidence in your people, but uh, in the case of India, there are too many instances in which promises are made and uh, eventual results are delayed. And that's understandable as well, because ultimately going to space is a very sophisticated technological and scientific effort that cannot be achieved lightly or easily. And uh, there are many who question whether or not India has the capacity to do it, at least in the immediate future. Media hype be what they may be, but uh, reality is that uh, it's not going to be easy.